and the shock is. Sounds like a squeegee. No good. Oh wow, this is huge. Yeah. It's a fun warm up. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> I don't. You don't feel it as much with the like I don't like uh, much less hand fatigue. Whether this is the coil or the combination, but so, all right. This. This. Well, you'll see. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey guys. Sorry, what? The berm they put in, rather than that weird flat berm. You can carry all your speed now from here, from up here. Because they put in a berm on the little path in here. Huh. Yep.
start throwing the bike around a little bit. It's like, yeah. It's gonna be kind of nice to go to, even the guys that work here, like a GoPro really stop nice video. That would, like, really good guys, and that's typically, in general, their favorite. Because as you get better, it's still mm. super rideable. You just ride it faster. Yeah. I just wish at the ends of some of the berms on the upper, not the part where you first get in, like after we stopped and came in, a couple of the berms, they just end a little too soon. Like mm. You're carrying a ton of speed and come in high like you're supposed to. It's just really tough to get down at the end and not go like, <coughs> flying off. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> and if you do, and it's gravelly like today, you end up getting all squirrely. Let me take some air out of the fork. Yeah. It's way too rough. And I'm not even close to using the stroke. That, oh, that last little on. section there used to feel so rough. And now, it's crazy. Oh, there we go. He's got a, he's taking some air to shock. We're gonna go wild turkey anyway, so. Which way are you headed? We're, we're going past Logan. Yeah. Man, man. No worries. What are you riding there? This is a specialized big hit. Sick. My dad, he rode it for like 20 years. Sick. Huh. Awesome. You guys come here a lot? What's that? You guys come here a lot? Uh, this is our second time here this year. We have a, we've got season passes, yeah. so, so hopefully. It's the way to go. Yeah. It just makes so much more sense. Yeah. 
He's messing with the shock, so go ahead. We got, he's gonna be in there. We're gonna, uh, we're gonna try and get him wild. Is wild turkey closed? He uh, said he noticed. Open last time we went by. Okay, good. All right, sweet. Yeah. Yeah, season passes are the way to go. It's like, I use, if you buy them in October, it's 200 bucks. Yeah. Like, we weren't sure then. Next year we'll do that, but yeah, no, their mom in particular was like, we're not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> do it enough, we'll go enough. We'll go a couple more times. Yeah. 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 <laughs> okay, we'll go Could not love a human child as much as I love this rear shock. <laughs> it feels so like soft, but then like it doesn't like you don't like Based on how it feels, I was thinking. Guys, okay? Yep. Yeah, the one thing I wish they did on the coil is to put a little O ring on the, that center post so you can do the same thing that this does. There's a rubber uh, bumper on it, yeah, the bumper is just but the bumper is a pain in the ass to push all the way to the top. I did it yesterday when I set the sag, but. I kind of get the feeling that. I never used the bumper. I always measured based on the, where the coil was. There's a reason I don't think it's just. I guess it's just relative height. I haven't thought about my bumper. One of the things he does is I know for some of them, he has like he uses he has different bumpers of different like shapes. Yeah. And durometers. I know yep. at least for the in, some of the internal bumpers he does it with, or even the external bumpers. He does it like VHS2. And it helps with your, helps the feel and resistance to bottom out. We'll see if this chatters. I loosened the coil too. Because it just feels like so everything is way too, and I'm not trying to. Is your compression, what's your compression like? Um, if your rebound's all the way open, that could be it too. On the coil? On the shock? If, if your rebound's all the way open... Yeah, it'll pop back up open, really it's fast. Gonna, it's going to jack you around faster. Because it's rebound control, so if you close it, it slows down your rebound. If you open it... Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so if that's all the way open, it could also be the reason it feels that way. But won't that accumulate? It, or it, it doesn't it, on coil. No, it, it, it could, but you, you still want some damping. Because if you don't have damping, it's like a pogo stick. So some damping, what it does is it slows it down enough that like, you, it's, a, it's a perfect balance, right? You don't want it to just be like launching you up and down. Yeah. But you also don't want it to pack up. So it's kind of like, you know, see how it feels and change if you need to. You could, or just change one variable at a time. I was just throwing that out there. Okay. Four. It's all the way open. I just did four clicks for a uh, rebound. Yeah, on the coil so you know the yeah i mean it just feels way too harsh and obviously i'm not you know i'm using half the stroke on my forks yeah. i'm not going off anything huge but no yeah in the chat that's, it, that's this is what it's about tuning so you got to figure it out and plus again the shim stack is the vanilla shim stack so once yeah it, it's right it's more than rideable but it'll feel even just keep in mind it'll feel even better once it's pregnant plus the first two laps all suspension feels like shit. <laughs> In my opinion.
That lower part's really smooth. Okay. That lower part's really smooth. I love that. Yeah, it's, it's fun. Well, That's turkey is a lot of fun. Yeah. One of my favorite trails. Well, maybe not anymore, but it used to be. Did they add that little section before? Yeah. Did they add that little section before? Um, you know how there's a drop and then the curve on the wall, and then you go into another drop. Yeah. Just before that section, I had never been on that. No, they. It's, have you ever gone there from Wild Turkey? I don't know. There wasn't a berm. You know the first one you came into. Yeah. You go up in the wall, and then there's a. Berm. Yeah, you can tell that's a fresh berm. Yeah. So it may have felt different. Otherwise, when you cut into this, if you cut in way lower if you come off Boulevard. You cut, yeah. You cut up a whole different section. Yeah, I had never been on that uh, higher section. That yeah. was fun. It was funny, though, because my brain was like, oh, we're already on it. But we weren't. Yeah. Kind of, we were technically yeah. because we were on that trail, but I thought we were already on the things that I just described. Yeah. That drop goes up to the wall berm. And then they took away, there was a large drop after you did the wall berm. No, the big one's still there. It's the one that's uneven. The uneven one? Oh, the yeah, 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 yeah. The, the, the uneven one's the big one? Yeah, yeah. They didn't change it much. That was actually, I think, my first time on it this year. They added the... Whoa, crap. That was gold. <laughs> it's a little tiny rock. Um, they added uh, a little, like, ladder thing before the next wall, before we get into this. Maybe. I don't remember that being there. I think, I, honestly, I think everything's the same there, except for... <sighs> that berm? Added, they added the berm. Other than that, it's, I think it's the exact same course. But it's, it's, for you, it's weird because figuring out where the new part was and where the old part was is like, wait a minute, is that new or just the part I didn't ride? Yeah. So I think the berm was the only thing new thing I, I noticed, but the berm's really nice. But before it was a really awkward flat turn, and now you have a berm with something too. Yeah, off uh, Boulevard, it's a rocky, fast turn, but it's loose because it's it just. I was always like, eh. Because it was like, tick, 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 yeah. and it was hard to make the corner. Yeah, because everything just, just, you just don't feel no stability in it. Yeah. Alrighty. Should we do the slalom course? You go in the right, right lane. I've never ridden the left. Oh. 